What's going on everybody? It's Game Unboxing Reviews here and welcome back to another LEGO Dimensions free roam video. So today we're going to be showcasing Slimer and Slimer is surprisingly very cool in this game. I mean don't get me wrong, I like the character, I always have. I mean Slimer's cool, he's a very iconic character from Ghostbusters. But when it comes to abilities, I was thinking, what's he actually going to be able to do? You know, I was very confused, and we saw, you know, he has the hot dog, and he can throw it, and stuff like that. Well, all the sausage, you know, whatever. Um, but yeah, and, and he throws it, and that's that was all I kind of saw. But then, when you actually see and you get him, he could do so many things. It's crazy. And one of my favorite things, and I'll get to, uh, you know, what comes with him in a second, but one of my favorite features to do with Slimer in this game is this. So basically what I'm going to do is this doesn't come in this pack. I just want you to know this comes in the level pack the, with uh, Peter Venkman and uh, the Ghost Trap. So this is the Ecto-1 from the level pack. And if you press triangle, you actually basically uh, take over it. You know, you, you kind of you consume it and then it glows and everything. And you don't actually see Slimer sitting in it. If you look carefully, you can see it's just the actual Ecto-1, which is pretty cool. I mean, that's one of my favorite features of this uh, character, just because it just looks so awesome when he can consume any vehicle or gadget and he basically becomes them. So I'll even do it with the Terror Dog as well. If we take the Ecto-1 off and we put the Terror Dog on from, uh, of course, the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man Fun Pack, there you go. He becomes the Terror Dog. Which I just love. I think that's a really cool feature to have in the game. And it's going to be great for stuff later on. You know, other packs that come out where you can become other things. It's just it's just a nice little feature. I really like it. I think it's really cool. Now, when it comes to the actual thing that does come in this fun pack, it's not the most exciting thing. I've got to be honest. I mean, it's it's alright. Uh, what could you really give Slimer, though? That's the thing. I mean, it's quite difficult. I'd imagine they had a hard time trying to work out what exactly to give him. So the best thing they could come up with was... A slime shooter, and that's fine. I mean that that makes sense. It's cool, but it, that's this is all it does. I mean it's nothing special. It it, it really. I, I rarely use it to be honest, but you know the main thing I like about this pack is Slimer. Slimer, if you're gonna get this pack, you should really be a big Ghostbusters fan who really wants Slimer, and that you just want Slimer. <laughs> That's mainly the reason. I don't think there's gonna be many people going out and buying this pack just because of this. But it does have some cool other forms. I'll give it that. So I'll show you as well. So I got the Slime Exploder, which does this. Uh, so it shoots a spray of slime, which is cool I guess and also it doesn't move so it has to sit like this uh, and even when you play as a character that has legs I think they don't even move of that either but then if we uh, hang on a second if we go to the final form this is the coolest thing about this like even though it's 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 okay I mean I don't really like it that much this is the coolest thing about it check this out so you hold down square and then there's like a, a missile strike or something of, of it's like an airstrike it's like a slime strike think of an airstrike but with slime and that's basically what it does and it's pretty cool I mean yeah that that I do like I've got to admit I do like that one and there's some cool skins and things you can change it into uh, and stuff like that so yeah it's it's all right now Slimer um, sadly I can't show off any of his you know combat abilities because this map for some reason doesn't have enemies I can actually fight from what I can find but um, you know he, he can punch and stuff like that and spin. Uh, if you hold down circle, he burps and uh, it, yeah, it, it damages enemies. I'm trying to think what else. So, of course, he can throw the sausage. Uh, so yeah, he can do all that. He can also fly, obviously. And, in case you're wondering, because obviously I know a lot of people probably want some of the swimming characters because they're very useful because they get you a lot of cool stuff. Just to show you, yes, Slimer can... Wait, can he? I thought he could. Can he do it? Yes, he can. Yes, yeah, Slimer can swim underwater, and he's very useful, and there's going to be some things you actually need, some puzzles, where you will find that, yeah, you can get under there with an underwater character, but Slimer's the one you actually need, because he can get past ghosts and stuff without them harming him, or anything like that. So, yeah, you'll need uh, Slimer quite a few times with some of the puzzles, if you aim to get 100%. Uh, in here right now, just touring the adventure world in a minute, really, because there isn't really much else to show for Slimer. Because remember, the fun packs, like I said, they're the they're the smallest value, and I mean that not in a bad way. Where these are the ones you shouldn't get. I mean it as you know, you've got you've got the uh, story packs, which are the biggest, which are obviously starting in September, which is awesome. Then we got the level packs, which is second best. Then we got the team packs, and then the fun packs, because the fun packs come with the least amount of stuff, but they're still cool. And like I said. Wizard of Oz one, awesome, really cool. 
so since I can't really show off, um, you know, uh, Slimer's abilities, you know, with, with this actual slime shooter, you know, there isn't really much to show for it. I've pretty much shown everything already. We'll just drive around the Ecto-1, why not, you know? And of course, you can put the siren on, in case you're wondering. And if this is your first time, you know, coming across some of the Ghostbusters content in LEGO Dimensions, then you'll be happy to know that while it is, you know, while they are adding uh, the new Ghostbusters, we also have the originals in this game as well. I mean, if you get the Peter Venkman uh, level pack, once you've beaten that level, you can actually play as all the Ghostbusters. So you can play as Venkman, Egon, Winston, and Ray. You can play as all of them whenever you want, and it's extremely cool. It really is, because it just adds to the value of why you should get that pack. And if you, uh, you know, are on the fence about the Ghostbusters level pack, I highly recommend it. Honestly, it is brilliant. I mean, the Adventure World's pretty cool. I, I like the level more than the Adventure World. But, um, no, the, the Ghostbusters level pack is very nice. Really, really cool pack, definitely. Uh, what else can we do? I guess we could just fly around. I mean, we could do a race, show how fast Slimer is. He is pretty fast. Go a bit. He is pretty fast. Oh, wait, we can fight Goza. If you ever wanted to see Slimer fight Goza, we can do that. You can totally do that. Wait a sec, where is she? Where is she? There she is. Oh, and he's making weird noises. Okay. <laughs> Take that! Goza! Oh, uh-oh. She's going to try to electrify me there. Yep, there she goes. Ah, no, 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 no. Bad Goza. Actually, you know what? Let's, uh... Let's bring out the slime shooter. Let's see if it's actually going to help us. You never know. And you know what? I'm not going to use this form. I'm going to use the final form because I want to see the whole slime strike thing. I think that's really cool. Okay. Now. Yes! It does work! Awesome. Come over here, Goza. Come over here. I'm going to take you down again. Is she going to come over here? Maybe we should uh, switch back to the normal form because we can still shoot you. Ha ha! Wow, the slime's actually quite strong. It just it takes her out in one hit, it seems. Like, well, it's, it takes one heart with every hit. Whoa. Okay, fine, we'll show off. No, 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 no. I guess we could uh, do the slime exploder. Ha ha! Oh, what? Come on. Is it even reaching her? I don't even know. Uh, no, I don't think it is. Okay, let's attack. And again, oh, one more hit and then she's down. I am the slime exploder. Yes, we did it. We defeated Goza. Wow. Slimer is actually the hero. <laughs> Who would have thought? Hey, lots of studs. Very nice. I need studs. <laughs> I need lots of studs, definitely. Oh, I had purple in sight there. Come on. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I mean, I've basically shown everything that Slimer can do. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Um, but no, really, that's about it. Um, the only thing I can't really show is obviously the combat moves, sadly. Um, but, you know, if you do intend to get this pack, then I'm sure you'll find, you know, there's some pretty cool moves. Um, yeah, it's, it's cool. I mean, like I said, with Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, if you're a fan of Ghostbusters, you're going to get this pack anyway, even if I say don't. And I'm not going to say don't, because it's your choice. I mean, I like it. I think it's cool. I like having Slimer in the game, but uh, the actual, you know, gadget you get, it's 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 just it's decent at best, really. It, 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 that's, that's as best as I can explain it, really. Um, but the thing is, though, you know, people are probably wondering, what would you say I recommend more, Stay Puft Marshmallow Man or Slimer? And I would say probably if you're wanting to, you know, get get through the game quite quickly and get lots of collectors, collectibles and stuff, get Slimer, because Slimer is extremely useful. I mean, he's a very useful character in this game. But Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, I don't know, he's quite fun to play as, because he can run around, he can grow big and smash stuff, but then again, so can Homer Simpson. So it's kind of it's kind of hard to decide. I mean, obviously the best uh, Ghostbusters pack for this game is the Ghostbusters level pack. I mean, for year one at least, for is the Ghostbusters level pack, because you get to play as Peter Venkman, Egon, Ray, Winston, you get to play through the movie, the first movie, you get the Ecto-1, you can customize it, and you can, you can trap ghosts, you actually get to capture ghosts, and it's really cool, that's definitely the highlight of, um, of the Ghostbusters content is the level pack, so if you're getting any pack from the Ghostbusters, that's the one you should get, definitely, but like I said, these, you know, Stay Puft and Slimer are still pretty cool. And of course, you can fly around the fire firehouse as Slimer as well, which is pretty neat. 
go out here. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. Stay tuned for lots more videos real soon. And as always, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.